Hey, what is up guys? So today, it is the first half of my last day of junior year, which is crazy. I feel like I did my first day of school vlog like two weeks ago. But yeah, so today it is the first half because the way that my school schedule works is that we get the first half of our classes one day and then the next half of our classes on the next day. So today I just had my last Spanish class, I had my last social justice class, and those were really fun classes. I really, really enjoyed them, and I have a lot of great memories in those classes. And I also had my last B study, which was pretty much a study that most juniors had, and definitely like most of my friends had. So those were just such great times doing homework and having crazy conversations together. So yeah, it was kind of nice to have like one last B study together. Isn't she in Rhode Island? No, yeah, she's in New York. I thought she was in Philadelphia. <laughs> And then my next class, last one of the day is math. Okay, so now I'm gonna get myself breakfast because I'm kinda hungry, kinda really tired, kinda wanna take a nap, but I have to do something after school. Crispy Hex. So my school has like 10 minute breaks between classes, so usually I'll just watch YouTube or I'll chat with my friends on a Zoom call, like this one. Oh my gosh, that is so freaky. Ew. Side profile check. I'm sorry. Ew. <laughs> Too bad our class color isn't purple. That oh seems coming. No. no. <laughs> it's come back. That one is literally like a demon. <laughs> like. <laughs> that one. Coming out of your closet. <laughs> Lila, that said $60 shipping. <laughs> It's the last one. We have to get it. Then we had M A T H math. And if you were in this class, you know who you are. Okay, so it is much later. <laughs> it is basically one o'clock, and I pretty much just took a nap. I had my math class, which was literally like ten minutes. Cause I mean, what do you do when you don't have any assignments due, and it's the last day of school? Especially not in Zoom. I kind of just in shambles right now, to be honest, because I had so many things that I was planning to do yesterday and today but that just didn't really end up happening i just have to adjust and Dumb. yeah that's pretty much the end of today today's the last day i'm looking out for school Yay. <laughs> so basically today for my schedule the first period is a study from eight o'clock to nine o'clock technically my first day of school has already started because it started at eight but i was studying so technically it didn't so okay but all of aj mitchell's songs hit different Sometimes you just need a vibe, even if you're not a good dancer. I think the meaning of summer is to be able to have a dance party in your room. I not really care if anybody's watching. Okay. AirPods are out. So homeboy over here, the park, decides to... They decide to be mowing the grass when I'm trying to film this video. Like really, like out of all the days for you to mow the grass, for all the days for it to be, all the times has to be, it has to be right now when I was playing the film. So if you guys hear that background noise, I can't really do anything about it. Can't even be sorry for it because it's not my fault. Like I'm not really mad, I'm just kind of like, really. Right now I literally look like a mess because, you know, I just look up. I actually have a really busy day today. Have to go to my school to pick up books and all that stuff and also get to get my senior shirts. I know, it's so weird. That's, that's weird. We're gonna talk about it later, but let me pick up my outfit. Okay, so I decided that I'm gonna keep the shorts because I think they're pretty cute. So this is the shirt on, it's super cute, and I really like like the flow of it. I really like the shirt for some reason. So I also want to tell you guys about this phone case. This is from the company Case App, and it is so cute. They sent me a couple of cases, and I really love them. They are super protective and super nice. I just got this ocean design, which is awesome. I'm also gonna be doing a giveaway on my Instagram of their cases, so make sure you follow me on there for when I post that. It's just Michaelified here. It'll be totally free. Entering is totally free, so make sure you guys enter that because their cases are so good and they have really cute designs and you can actually design your own in my get ready with me is i usually do some type of makeup or something even though i literally don't wear makeup to school i'm gonna put some lip gloss on this is my favorite lip gloss i'll link it down below in the description and also with the case company case app that i was talking about i'm gonna be linking their company in the description and i'm gonna be linking my instagram so that you guys can follow that and enter the giveaway to get a free case from them make sure you guys check that out i think i'm gonna skip concealer just because i don't know i want to embrace that glossy natural bear look what i will be doing is i will be doing my flower beauty 
blush balms. Ah! Oh my gosh, that's way too much. I'm really gonna have to blend this out, guys. <laughs> oh my gosh, no. We're gonna go for it. Okay, let's go. We're gonna blend it out. Blend it out, blend it out, blend it out, blend it out, blend it out. Oh my gosh, I put so much on. Ooh, I look like a clown. So I wanted to talk about how like, just how my junior year went. It honestly flew by for me. I don't know, like I literally like remember talking to you guys in the beginning of the year and being like, yeah, like I'm not ready for this year. Because basically everyone that was like a senior that year and just anyone that like went to high school basically was telling me that like, oh my gosh, yeah, junior is the hardest. It's the worst. Like literally so stressful and i was like great like i love that and i just i kind of just accepted it and i was like yeah like okay like that's how it's gonna be so i went into junior year expecting the absolute worst you know honestly it didn't really meet that expectation which is really nice so yeah i'm kind of gonna go into senior years with that method because now i'm hearing that senior year is the worst or at least senior fall is like brutal okay now i'm gonna put on my favorite highlight which is from wet and wild it is part of this limited edition mega glow highlighting palette i love this my favorite shade in this is this like pinky iridescent shade i just it's so beautiful i feel like junior year it had its ups and downs i definitely had quite a few downs that i will literally never forget which is unfortunate but i feel like everyone like that happens to everyone i'm excited for you senior year though i feel like senior year is kind of the year at my school and just like at most schools that you know high schoolers have the most spirit you know obviously because they get privileges and they get all these um fun games and stuff i'm just hoping that in senior year i have a lot of spirit and um you know even if i'm like tired or something like that and you know i don't know in a bad mood like i would just want to like have that spirit to kind of just carry us through the year pretty much um i have this palette that my cousin gave me and i love it so much it's, it's a black owned business actually and i've always wanted to try out this brand and i've had this palette for like since christmas so i really do like this palette but this is called the beauty bakery proof is in the pudding eyeshadow palette the packaging is gorgeous and the eyeshadows are so gorgeous i'm gonna be using red pudding as my like crease shade yo it's weird to be a senior doesn't really feel like it what else was i saying oh yeah so for today the plan for today that's what i'm saying so basically right now i'm filming this get ready with me part and it's e-study which e-study was definitely one of my favorites because i feel like e-study was just usually like a chill and calm time and even though like i didn't have any friends in that study like i really enjoyed it actually because I just was able to kind of like breathe and do my work and stuff and you know like not procrastinate which is nice It kind of makes you feel like a oh wow I'm actually doing my work That just kind of makes you feel good It was very very thankful for this study especially during quarantine because like for today it's EFGH and E is not the first day period in the day So for quarantine I didn't have to wake up until 9 every single day that we had day 2 let's say And we had day 2 like twice a week so that was so nice So the next period I have is English and oh my gosh that was one of my favorite classes ever Just the people in it were so funny and our teacher is so funny that class like if i was ever stressed or anything like that like that class would always lift me up which is so nice and it reminded me of my old school yeah it was just so fun like it just lifted my mood every day and not a lot of classes i can say do that some of my classes are pretty quiet so i'm also putting mango pudding in the crease as well to kind of give it a little bit of orange i have english class next that's my first one okay so the class after that is globo which is global politics because my school has this ib program Man, i'm not even gonna explain that because it's way too confusing that's also one of my favorite classes. I just really loved the content in that class. It's under like a history class and usually I'm not like a history person or anything like that but that class is really interesting because it talks about like current events and just like the world. And something that I've always hated about history was we only learned about the US and Europe. Like okay great they're two countries with a lot of history and you know we get a lot of our laws and stuff or whatever from them. But like I cared about other countries too you know like I want to learn about we still haven't learned about Canada but I've wanted to learn about the countries in Africa. I wanted to learn about China and the Middle East, like all different kind of countries. We learn about that in this class because it's global politics. I just like learning about the world, you know, instead of just two parts of the world. So, and then also that teacher is amazing. And yeah, he's just, he's a goat, he's a G. But yeah, so that class has always been fun. And then my last class is AP Chem. And I know I took AP Chem like, what, why did I do that? Like what? Yeah, I really loved chemistry last year. I had a really great teacher and yeah, I really liked it for some reason. So then I decided to take AP, why not? I totally don't regret taking the class. It was really interesting. And also my teacher was really chill. She's awesome. So I think my makeup's done. Oh yeah, and I also, one more thing I want to talk about AP Chem. Um, if you're considering take it, take it. I don't think you'll regret it. I feel like go for it. If you're considering it, go for it. It's a great class. And I don't know. I just don't think people should be as scared of it as people make it out to be. I don't know. I think the hype over the hardness of the class is very overrated. So take it. Be confident in yourself if you think, oh yeah, I might like this. 
this or you know you want to challenge yourself yeah i don't know i just feel like it's a good class to take and not many people take it because they are scared of the class and i get that but don't be scared so it's about nine but i'm not worried because my teacher usually starts later after class there's this award ceremony this like last year awards kind of thing that my school always does it's usually awards for the juniors so that's actually really exciting um who knows if i'll get an award but they don't tell us it's always a surprise it's called this book awards i literally don't know anything about it they don't really tell us but I guess we'll learn today. And then also um, tomorrow is actually um, my school's doing the last day car parade. But yeah, let me read this email so that I don't get late to my class. Okay, never mind. My teacher sent the email early, so I gotta go to class right now. Apparently I was rushing for nothing because like I said earlier, my teacher usually starts them from 9.10 to 9.20. Um, which is actually really nice because especially since I've been study, I don't have to worry about waking up super early or anything like that. But yeah, so today she's starting at 9.10, but that's actually two minutes from now, so it's good that I rushed a little bit. Okay, so I just had my English class and my Glopo class, and um, both of them were actually super fun. Um, my English class, she just went over like summer work and stuff, and then we actually, we wrote like these scripts kind of for one of the plays that we read, and she wanted like people in class to read them, and no one in my class like wants to read theirs, but she, she picked mine and a couple other classmates that like we could read and we actually read mine in class and honestly like for me i typically like wouldn't do that just because like since no one else does it like i wouldn't do it that's kind of like i don't know i feel like a lot of high schoolers can relate to that but i actually was just like you know what like i want to do it like it's fun like why not it's the last class so we did it and it was actually really funny i don't know it's just like why not you know and then i had my glow class and oh my gosh it was just oh it was just so good i just wanted to let you guys know that i am like 80 percent sure that my whole class saw me doing that so but besides that this was a great class pretty small which was convenient in this case but yeah overall it was really chill and challenging and i really enjoyed it but yeah i don't know i feel like for senior year like i want to be like really hype like and actually have school spirit which is weird no i feel a lot of school spirit when i'm a senior because like that's like yeah we have a little bit because like, you just moved in mm -hmm. and then senior you get so hyped because it's your last year yeah exactly Hey guys, what's up? I'm back. I just went to my Zoom award ceremony. That was super fun. Um, there was definitely some funny moments and just like the end of the year slideshow and just, it was really nice. So right now it is basically two o'clock. So I have to Zoom over to my school to get my books and to get my senior shirt. Hey guys, what's up? She be looking like alfalfa. So today is the next day. It is Friday and today is going to be the car parade. And oh, also I got my senior shirt. I didn't show you guys that. So that's what I'm going to be putting on right now. I'm probably gonna keep the same shorts because why not? I'm kind of just really lazy <laughs> to be honest. But also like they're nice shorts so. so this is the shirt so just the seniors and i've seen like other people have like this kind of same shirt so i don't know if that all schools can do that i don't really know i've really paid attention to that and then this is our little like slogan it just says signing off with the grade 21 because i'm graduating 21 which is crazy but yeah so i'm gonna change it's kind of long because i'm like super super short so i might like tuck it in or something but i'll figure it out i have my senior shirt on so now we're gonna be leaving and going so I didn't film the parade because I wanted to protect my teacher's privacy, but it was super fun. And then after the parade, my mom and I went to one of our favorite spots to get french fries and pick lemonade and just sit by the water. And we love going here. It's just so peaceful and food is amazing. So yeah, that was just an awesome way to end my junior year. And it was a pretty good week to kick it off this summer.